What's going on? You need to choose your friends more carefully. What's she on about? This Jezebel has been sleeping with my son. Oh, you've been sleeping with Ross. No, you idiot. Pete. What? Roxy plays Emma Dale Zilla, joins me now. Oh, my goodness me. It had to happen. It had to, you know, we, we knew it was only a matter of time. Yeah, I mean, it's something like that's always going to come out. I don't think at that point, though, she believes it. I think she just thinks she's trying to stir things up. Yep. And, you know, Priya, best friend, doesn't believe it for a second mm. in that moment. But we've all known, we've all known for ages, and I we're know. shouting at the television. And we have, after those scenes, Priya and Layla get together in the in the Pear Tree office, in Layla's office, and, um, yeah, it does, it does yeah, all come out. Because we've been talking this morning, haven't we, about, about the Roonies and about, and oh about also it's... second chances and, and all of that, and how difficult that, that is, you know? And, and here she, you know, your character's in that sort of position as well. I think from Layla's point of view, I think the betrayal from Pete, she can, she can handle and she can come back from quicker because I think she's been let down by so many men in the past. Right. There's some part of her that suspected or that always kind of didn't fully trust because she's right. not had a lot of good relationships. Whereas with Priya, that's her best friend. That's someone she stood by through mm. so much heartache, who's always been there for her. They're like sisters. That betrayal, I think, yeah. goes beyond and I think will be much harder to forgive, if ever. Yeah, to be honest. It'll be yeah. really interesting to see what that relationship's going to be like yeah. between the two of them. You know, how that's going to resolve itself and whether it indeed it ever will. I don't think you can truly come back no. from something like that, especially with a friend. I mean, I think maybe in relationships, people can be a little bit more understanding, especially if there's children involved and things like that. But with a friendship, the, f the absolute foundation of that is, is trust, and yep. that's been completely destroyed. And also, I think Layla might want to take the higher ground at some point and go, yeah, I can move on. I'm bigger than this but ultimately mm, could hard. you ever really forget that i don't i don't think not so. from your best mate no not from your best mate i just don't see how you can emmerdale is doing so well right how now exciting i know in the awards are tom are they tonight or tomorrow tonight They're tonight yeah and we've got loads TV of amazing choice, people like lauren orton's up for best comedy I know, it's good isn't it yeah it's really really good so yeah fingers crossed i can't be there because i'm working but yeah hopefully hopefully it'll mm. be another sweeping of the board we I shall would, see well you know they, they have gone through the, the whole show has just gone through such an amazing yeah, it's been amazing great from the, part from of it start of the year all the way through all the way through now look you're married in real true life to an actor i'm married in real true life to do, an actor. did you guys meet when you were doing shakespeare or did you meet oh did, no we met at, at the national just down the road we were doing yeah. a play called rafter after it was a comedy we met just over 10 years ago now is it really yes we've been together a long Gosh. time now but he's here today because i didn't get to see him all week so i dragged him up and you very <laughs> kindly accommodated us so yeah Quite right we've too. Had, uh, we've <laughs> very happy very happy to have some conjugal bliss i think that's, that's absolutely fine we're very happy happy with that it's very good now did you do any yoga this morning because I, I do I only to... did 15 minutes because I thought I might be doing some this morning because one of the producers said oh we might get you in some yoga poses I love you. look at so this. I was like oh my gosh I better warm what up at least called? no but oh gosh uh, I'd be in hospital um, and I think, do you know what I've said this before I think the thing is with Instagram and things like that you always you only need to hold it for a second you always <laughs> want to do your show off pose <laughs> but ultimately as I was saying to you before we went on air yeah. yoga's for everyone and yeah. the simplest stretching and a little bit of breathing can really do what yoga's supposed to do, which is calm you, bring sure. that union between breath and body, and you know. So I mean, they're all good fun, but, no, but you don't have to do them. But you are proper. You know what you're doing. I mean, we can find you on channels and everything, and yes, do it with you. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, but um, I think there's all, you're always learning as well. That's something right. you know. I'd like to say because you. I mean, I go to lo lots of different teachers, and even though I'm a teacher myself, I think it's important to keep growing, yeah. to keep learning, um, and to keep sharing what you learn. And I think sometimes you'll learn more from beginners because they'll say. I'm finding this challenging, I'm finding that challenging, and then it's how do you a, modify a pose to suit everyone, because yoga's supposed to be for everyone. Yep, it's not for people that are flexible, and, you know, it's for absolutely everyone. Well, I think your character should do some yoga. I'll, I'll send you off. <laughs> I I'll think send she you needs off to, to do, do some, some yoga. yoga. And it'll be fine. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Absolute joy to Absolute see you. Absolute pleasure, yeah. Thank you very much Generally. indeed. Right. Still to come between now and 9.25.